seeing him. So I'm going to make sure I don't because I don't dox people. Hey, Joe, I got this as a free gift or as a free replacement for a broken one. It's the King of France, a close knockoff of Louis Vuitton Ombre Nomad. Since Louis Vuitton costs three hundred dollars, enjoy a lot cheaper. The bottle is fragile because it's actually two pieces of glass seamed together. Hey, you! No, hey, your frag brothers care. Get well. There's two small ones inside of the box. So he's talking about this one here. Actually, I want to show you guys what else I got too. I'll order these guys on Amazon. I know y'all are like, oh, hopefully he accidentally doxes himself. That's not what the case is gonna be, homie. I'm not gonna dox myself. Actually, let's see this. I go grab my knife, but my knife is in my closet. You get them for a dollar a piece. Mountain Dew Kickstarts. I love these things. I get them for a dollar a piece on Amazon. So 12 bucks for the whole thing. All right. So we have this one. I'm going to go into this blind. I'm going to attempt to see what's in here. Pick out the notes. Hmm. That's actually pretty cool. All right. Two pieces fused together, that for sure is true. But I see a plastic, I think. I'm not gonna mess with it too much, but this looks like plastic piece over the bottle. Interesting. Let's go. Ooh. I'm gonna give it a minute to change. I like this DNA. I think they do this DNA too much. But I like this DNA. So I'm going to give it a minute to change to see what's up. But right now I want to say Invictus. Yeah, it's like, it's Invictus, so you get the cardamom, there's definitely some tonka bean in here, there's gotta be, um, ooh, something a little bit different than Invictus, actually, um, it's the Invictus, but it's got like a, I don't really, I want to say woody, I don't know, it's not sandalwood, I don't think, um, It's louder than Invictus in a way, like a, not in a negative way, but it's got more of a pop. So there's some kind of, not spicy, but get that opening again real quick. Nice atomizer, by the way. Yeah, there's some kind of, sp There's something different about it in here. I don't know what it is. Because I have Invictus. I've got plenty of Invictus clones. Is there like a tobacco note or some kind of spicy note in here or something? Because I'm picking up on something spicy. And warm. It's different than Invictus. It starts off. It starts off Invictus, but it, it, then it, what is it? What is this? Yeah, it's got something spicy in there. I don't know if it's a woody spicy or if it's a tobacco or like anise or something like that, but it's, it's something spicy in there. What 
are the notes of the King of France pour -Om? Yeah. Yep. Uh, it's looking like... Yeah. So I'm getting lavender, mint, and bergamot. Notes of cinnamon and cumin, which are the spicy notes I was picking up on. And orange blossom. Base notes are vanilla, amber, tonker bean, sandalwood, and cedar. I said it was woody. I said it was spicy. And I said it was invictus, which is like the, the, the tonka bean. Got some amber in there. This is nice. This is like invictus, but if... I like this. I like it. At first, when it first opens up, you just get Invictus. You're like, oh, another Invictus clone, whatever. But then, like, it changes. You start picking up the spiciness, and it turns into something that is different than Invictus. It's nice, dude. I like it. Now, I know who these are for. Those are for her. These are for her and not for me. I know. But I'm going to try them anyway. Nostalgia Gone Fishing. These are Avon. Country Cabin. All right. We're going to see. Ooh. Nice. Nice. Is it, this is a gourmand. It's it's chocolate, so I know there's some patchouli in there. It's not the strongest in the world. Oh, okay. Give this alcohol a second to wear off. This is... Not like boozy alcohol, but like perfumer's alcohol. This is sweet. So there's tonka bean in here. There's some patchouli. It's a gourmand. Um, ooh, it's nice. Obviously, I can't answer for any of the performance on these guys because I just got them. I'm getting... Patchouli, heavy, heavy patchouli, some tonka bean, maybe a little bit of vanilla, maybe, and some woody, no oh, some sandalwood in there, I think. Let me try that out. Let me see. What are the notes of Nostalgia by Avon? I think. Okay, I guess, uh, oh, no, wait, they're not Avon, sorry. What are the nodes of Nostalgia Gone Fishing? Mm-hmm. No, there's more than that. It says Citrus, Sage, and Sandalwood. Negative. Negative. No. There is some patchouli in here. There has to be some patchouli in here. Fragrantica. I'm not accepting that answer. I don't accept this. Okay, I'm going to go right to the website, I think. <laughs> I do not accept this. There's some patchouli in here. I know there's patchouli in here. These are niche. Wait, if these are niche, why did it just say Walmart has them? There's no way. There's no, I mean, there's no way that they're, that they're not niche or, I don't know. Okay, it's not telling me, but there is some, there's some patchouli in here. There has to be. I don't want to have the rest of the video be. 
Nostalgia collection, yeah. No, I don't believe that there's not just... No. They're, they're, they're not giving me all the notes here. There's some patchouli in here. There has to be. I'm determined. I'll find out an update in a review. And this is Country Cabin. Oh. Aaron Terrence Hughes. And notes of Ambroxan. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, no, no. Aaron Terrence Hughes would be... <laughs> That's him. No, for real, bro. Uh, citrus is all I'm getting. I don't really smell any Ambroxan, but I'm not too familiar with what Ambroxan smells like because I don't use it. But this is citrus floral. Um, what else? Bring your alcohol. Don't do that again, Joe. All right. Yeah, just citrus and florals all I'm getting. Yeah, I just did the thing. <laughs> uh, citrus and floral is really all I'm getting. And the citrus is either going to be like a lemon or maybe a little bit of woody notes, but I'm not really, I'm not really sure on that one. But lemon or like orange, something loud. What are the notes of Nostalgia Perfumery Country Cabin? I was way off on this one. Oud, Vetiver, and Pink... No. Tell me, they're... I didn't get any oud in this. Maybe that's what the woody notes are. I definitely didn't get any vetiver. Um, pink pepper? No. But there's some citrus in there. Are you kidding me? Okay. Hold on. Walmart has the notes listed. Walmart coming through for your boy because Freddie Grant could let me down. I think. Okay. Country, country cabin. There's uh, Ariana Grande, Baccarat Rouge 540, whatever. Yeah, it says that there's, um, the only other note that I'm picking up on is it says citrus, sage, no, it says, uh, no, it doesn't say citrus. I'm confused. And, how you walk carry these at Walmart if these are niche? Maybe it's not a niche line. Either way, I did good on the first two. That third one threw me for through a loop. And I like oud, and I did not pick up on any any oud out of that. But two out of three, I bet I did good on the first two. Later.